Good morning. Welcome to 21 Days of Prayer and Fasting. My name is Leida Centeno, and I have the pleasure of serving as a director of member care on staff, and I'm also a deacon. I'd like to welcome you to join us during our weekday morning prayer and also to our one-hour prayer meeting tonight. All of the information on how to join us will be in the description of this video. Our prayer focus for today will be mental health, and I will be reading from John 16:33. These things I have spoken to you, so that in me you may have peace. In the world you have tribulation, but take courage, I have overcome the world. In these days we hear so much about mental illness, we cannot ignore it. In the news we hear about people who appear to be doing great, they're happy and healthy, and suddenly they seem to take their own lives, and then we hear about their struggles with mental illness. Jesus, knowing his disciples will be needing encouragement because he was going to the cross, he tells them, in this world, you will have troubles. Today, we are his disciples. Can you hear him? You might be experiencing depression, anxiety, bipolar disorder, perhaps a chronic illness that has left you with uh, clinical depression or anxiety. Perhaps trauma has caused these issues in your life, or you are a caretaker. Our adversary, the devil, may have had you silent right now, feeling ashamed because you are not able to get over this issue. Jesus wants you to know that in him you can have peace. In him you can rest, and you are not alone. In that same chapter, John chapter 16, the Bible says that Jesus left us a helper, one that would comfort us in our hour of need, one that will lead us to all truth. Would you take a moment and pray with me now? Father God, thank you for your son. Thank you for his death and resurrection. Thank you for your Holy Spirit that will lead us to all truth. We thank you for your presence in every heart right now. We ask that you will be present with us and that you would allow us to not feel shame and give us the courage to be able to ask for help when we need it. Teach us to be overcomers like your son. We ask all these things in the matchless name of your son, Jesus Christ. Amen.